Today we I will be talking about the layers of the Earth. Let's get into this. The Earth has four main layers, the crust, the mantle, the outer core, and the inner core. The crust is made up uh, of two parts. It has the continental crust, which is thicker and is made up mostly of granite, and it is more malleable, while the oceanic crust is less malleable, it's more hard, more brittle, and it is made up mostly of ba basal basalt. And then below that is the mantle. The mantle is what what uh it has convection currents and it helps move the crust around and it kind of drives plate tectonics. It will push up through the crust and push uh the crust apart in some places, such as along the Mid Atlantic Ridge, and then it will go together in other places. Now, that is called the, uh, what happens at the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, where it starts splitting apart, that's called, uh, diverging, that's a divergent boundary, and then where it comes together, and, uh, and that's called the convergent boundary, and then there's other places where it just slides past each other, and that's called a transform. So, mantle convection, yes, uh, it helps push around the plates and it also will force it helps force up the lava through cracks in the crust and push it around making plate tectonics work so below the mantle is the outer core which is made up mostly of liquid iron and nickel and it creates our magnetosphere which protect helps protect earth from rays from the sun, electromagnetic, electromagnetic waves, which would blow away our atmosphere if we had a solid, a completely solid core. And below the outer core is the inner core, which is solid iron and nickel. It's solid from pressure, not because it's cold down there. It's extremely hot, just, it's about as hot as the surface of the sun, which is pretty hot, and it's solid from pressure and it spins slightly faster than earth and that helps move around the outer core which helps create our magnetosphere and it the inner core gets bigger and bigger because of earth's cooling as time goes on okay take number three on this the lava would be this represents a divergent boundary where the plates are coming apart the lava is pushing itself self up through the uh crust and then the pistons represent that pushing uh and cooling so they'll push it and then i'll have to go place these here and then this happens again every well it always happens and then i just keep doing that and then every once in a while the magnetism of the earth will flip and i'll have to place and i'll place a different kind of stone for that This would be like um, an earth model where this is the thickest layer, the, the stone is the thickest layer, so this would be the mantle. The thin uh, white slabs up there, the only reason they're on the top is because I can't place them sideways, they turn into that. Um, they would be, they're the thinnest layer, so they would be the crust, and then the core is a solid iron block, and the outside is lava, so this would be the outer core and inner core.